how I found this one. And because her swatches are so amazing, I, this matches me perfectly. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. So, okay guys, I found another foundation that I am completely fallen in love with and it is the By Terry Terribly Denseless Tint Serum Foundation. It's a wrinkle control serum foundation. So. Let me just start by saying I bought this foundation and another By Terry foundation because of the By Terry Terribly Denseless Concealer. I love that concealer so much. It just makes your under eyes flawless. It's so good for more maturing eyes that I had to try the Terribly Denseless foundation. So I'm just going to quick read to you exactly what this foundation claims to do. Okay, so this foundation says it's the first wrinkle control and firming serum foundation scientifically proven and approved that improves skin density, diminishes lines, and simultaneously treats all signs of aging. It combines a revolutionary, patented, rejuvenating, active ingredient with an optimal makeup correction that immediately targets surface wrinkles and provides deep down and lasting global results. It says it's a genuine complexion rejuvenator. It's 50% skincare, 50% makeup for 100% anti-aging effectiveness. So it's got all these, you know, anti-aging ingredients as well as um, kind of, it says it has a mimic factor. It just makes your skin look flawless while reducing lines and wrinkles at the same time. So again, it's uh, part skincare and part makeup, which as I feel like as I'm getting older, I am really drawn to these type of foundations. I just think they're going to be so beneficial for my skin. As you all know, I'm a skincare junkie. Skincare is my number one love because you got to have good skin to make any type of makeup look good anyway. But as I'm getting older, I'm really, really feel like I'm getting drawn to these type of like skincare makeup combinations. And I love this one. It is super lightweight on my skin. And if I had to compare this, you know what I would say? I would actually say it's very similar to my Paracone MD, the No Foundation Foundation Serum that I love. You guys know I love that, that um, No Foundation Serum. It's so light. I would say it's very similar in like feeling towards that one, but it has more coverage. So this, I would say it has like a light to medium coverage, whereas the, the Paracone is definitely a very like sheer to light coverage. But it kind of feels the same on the skin and kind of reminds me of that Paracone one. So I am in the shade 8, which is Warm Sand, and it just comes in a pump like this. It's a gorgeous, nice glass bottle, um, and you can see that, oh, let me move my sleeves. So this is what it looks like when you pump it out. It's just a liquidy, um, more on the runny side. If I leave my hand like this, you'll see it start kind of moving a little bit. It's more on the liquidy side, but again, this is the shade eight in warm sand. That's what I have. And it's a perfect, perfect match to my skin. So again, this is a more expensive foundation. I believe it was $115. I actually got it for 20% off on beauty.com right before Christmas. Um, they were doing like a 20% off. So I did get it for that, but it's $115. You get one fluid ounce, so it's your basic, typical amount of foundation. It just has such amazing qualities to it, and it just kind of um, diffuses flaws on your face, and again, it has those long-term benefits of using it. So why not use a foundation um, that kind of helps your skin as you get older anyway? So that's what, like, that's what I said. That's what I'm just like really drawn to these type of foundations. But I've been wearing this now for a couple weeks since I got it, and it lasts forever on my skin. I think this would be really, really good for all skin types. I have normal to oily skin. It works amazing. I do, um, towards the end of the, end of the day, um, have more of a glow to my skin. Not like a shiny, gross, oily glow, but just like a normal glow. But I think if you have dry skin, it's just going to be amazing for you as well. So I do think this would be so good for so many skin types, which is awesome. So this foundation does come in a wide variety of shades. And I'm actually going to link my friend's blog down below, thebeautyprofessor.net, because that's how I found my match in this foundation. So it's so hard to find matches to foundations online. So I am like obsessed with her blog. It's the best blog. She always has the best foundation swatches and she has the whole line of this foundation. She has every single swatch. Like she swatches them on her arm in multiple lighting situations. So you can really get a good feeling of what your uh, match would be. And that's how I found this one. 
And because her swatches are so amazing, I, this matches me perfectly. So I'm going to link her information down below to her blog in case you are interested in finding a match for this as well because her blog is like super helpful with finding a match. So I'm going to show you guys a demo of me applying this foundation. You're gonna see how smooth and lightweight and how flawless it covers your skin and it's just so beautiful, I can't even describe, I love it. So I'm just going to jump into that demo right now and you guys can see how it applies. Okay guys, I'm using the By Terry Terribly Denseless Tint Serum. This is in the shade 8, Warm Sand, and it just comes in a pump like this. And I'm going to be using my Marc Jacobs Foundation Brush, the Face 2 brush, to blend out this foundation. So you guys are gonna see how it applies. It comes out, you know, it's kind of a more liquidy, runny foundation, but I'm just gonna dab it on. I have no primer on because we're testing this foundation out, so we are not using any primer, and we're just gonna blend out with our brush. And I've tried it with multiple brushes, and every brush I've tried it with works perfect. Okay, so there it is on my skin. It's absolutely gorgeous. It dries to a nice, um, very natural finish. It's supposed to be like a matte, radiant kind of finish. Um, it's just a beautiful, beautiful finish. It feels very, very light on your skin and it dries very quickly so you don't feel any tackiness or anything like that. It just feels so good and looks so natural on your skin. So that is what it looks like um, right after I apply it. So I'm gonna do the rest of my makeup and I will be right back. Okay guys, I'm back with the rest of my makeup on. So this is the finished look of the foundation. It is so amazing, I love it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go go about my day and I will check in with you again in a few hours and I will show you guys just how this foundation holds up because it's amazing. And again, I don't have a primer on under this foundation so I will just check back in with you in a couple hours and we will see how it's holding up. So, okay guys, I am back. It has been a couple hours. I've just been out running errands and just going places with my family and doing all that kind of good stuff. So I am back. As you can see, my makeup has not budged in the slightest. It still looks Seriously, so flawless, and I'm telling you guys right now, this foundation is amazing. It's gonna be good, like I said, for all skin types. If you have normal, if you have dry, I don't know if it's gonna be good if you have super, super oily skin, and that I don't know, but for me, I have more combination normal to oily, and it's amazing. And I think, you you know, all the way down to the dry spectrum can definitely wear it. Again, it has the anti-aging ingredients and help, you know, with all those mature skin problems that we get as we age. So it's just a kind of like all-in-one good for your skin foundation, which I've just, like I said, I've just been drawn to those lately and just definitely see a difference when I wear them because they just help to hide flaws instead of like create flaws. Like a lot of foundations will, you know, if they get cakey, if they create lines, you know, they settle into lines, those will make you look older. So you need to find a good foundation that really works for more mature, you know, aging skin because we're not, you know, 20 years old anymore and you know, not every foundation is gonna work for us. So this foundation is amazing. And again, if you have more mature skin, it's going to be beautiful on you. It is a little bit more on the pricey side, but that's why I wanted to do this review just to let you guys know that you know it is worth the price tag and I really really love it so I hope you guys enjoyed this review and demo of this foundation from all the feedback I've heard from people that that have tried this and wear this they absolutely love it as well I don't think I've heard a bad thing about this foundation so let me know down below if you try it I would love to know what you guys think as well and I will see you guys in my next video bye